welcome back to season five of the Fort Worth Armadillos. Um, just have to reacclimate my stuff myself with what's going on. Yeah, we got our crew pretty well put together. Right, and first thing I wanted to do was introduce a new expansion team. You can only add six teams. Huh. So you can't go from a 12 team league all the way to a 36 team league. That is extremely upsetting. So. We're still going to do it, and we're still going to add an expansion team. Let's see here. It's just where are we going to do it? League expansion. I need to think. Let's think of look. Oh, wait, I have a locations list. It's just I have a locations list that's like 30 long. Um... I think I know where we're going to do it next. Jacksonville. And if I can't find a team, then I have a second location. Jacksonville. Elites. Eh. Jacksonville University. Shout out. What is this? The Rattlers. Meh. Meh. Maybe though. Possibility. Jacksonville Lightning. Meh. Meh. What is this? Jacksonville Barracuda. That's that's it. Jacksonville Barracuda will be the next expansion team in the league but other than that we need to get this on track I'm also gonna refresh my memory as far as from my memory of the previous champions. I know we have one, but League News, League History, NBA History, we don't want most valuables. Past champions, the Rally Blue Jays, Kansas City Stealth, Pittsburgh Ironmen, and then the St. Louis Spirits. Okay. So we gotta put our name on this list. We 100% do. Let's just get that process started right now. And we win 74-58. Graham and Armstrong. Vaughn had a good game. How about that? I mean, we got the squat Thorpe. What? what? I wasn't I gonna think. I was thinking of trading Thorpe, wasn't I? Who's I thinking of trading him? For? Four. Way Kai was an option. Our boy Hart was definitely an option. Who would I rather have? Probably Dan Hart, Edmund Thorpe for Dan Hart, and we're going all in this. Whoa! I predict we're going to be good though, so I'd be willing to do this. Okay, but they don't like that, so they want this pick. They really don't want. 
two first round picks from us. How about three? We got our boy Dan back. Let's go, baby. Dan Hart, welcome back. It, yeah. You broke our heart <laughs> a few years ago. Yeah, definitely broke our heart a few you, Why does this only let you have six expansion teams? That's just so dumb. Alright, let's see here. Dan Hart. One of the best players in the league, I must say. And we got him back. Shout out. So let's go. We got Green Bay next. Our squad. We're only one to know as of now. But... Why is Billick being part of every single trade possible? Green Bay against Fort Worth. Come on now. First game with Dan Harper. Hey, we took the win 73 to 70. Awesome game had 24. Hart. Meh. 10 points. Armstrong played well. He's down on points this year, though. Very strange. Just going through, looking at everybody. Throwback to Bates Diop. He's earned so many contracts with us simply off that first year. Frankie Graham is our boy. What's Ball looking like? Still hasn't shot her. Why was I about to do that? We got a simcast every game in this one. Mixed it up. Check out. I don't know when these are all going to go out, but we lost this one. We're struggling to score at the moment. What's our... 10 minutes a game, okay. 3-0 and Louisville. It's our 2-1. and We lost that one as well. Jeez. Not scoring very much. He shoots 73%. Look, man, I need you to shoot a little bit more. And he's got a B minus three pointer. Let me take a look what that stat actually is. For never shooting or making a three, 73 three pointer. If you could shoot like a little bit, right? to shoot a little bit more. Dan Hart, be our boy, man. He's supposed to lead us, and then Armstrong's supposed to pull alongside. All right, so simulate through here. We're two and two on the year. Can't really go for that. I don't know why I thought that St. Louis would trade their pick, but here we go. They got Edmund Thorpe now. We killed him. Thorpe, what you nine points. He's he literally balled out in the Bronx for two years. Comes to us and just sucks. Armstrong and Hart played well. How about that? We're back on top. Except we aren't. We've just never been on top. Baltimore. Win that one. Okay. Armstrong played extremely well once again. And we got Nashville. Four and two on the year for us. Come on, Fort Worth. Armadillos lose. 
struggled and we gave up 20 points to Philip Blake and William Caldwell. Not ideal. Second green game versus Green Bay. We lost. We blew it. We blew it. Dang it, man. So what are we now? Four and four? That's it? Let's take a look at player stats. 18, 12, 11, 8, 7. It's just what, what are we sucking at? Points per game, we are, where are we? Right in the middle, seven. Points allowed. We have good defense, but we're not scoring enough. It's weird, why aren't we scoring enough? We have so much offensive weapons, so many offensive weapons, and we blew another one. I don't know what's going on right now. Just seeing if there's a gem in here somewhere. You never know. 7 1 center. Okay, we got Louisville. They're 7 and 5 now. They started off 3 0. Oh. We lost another. Hearts hurt. Broke his hand, he's out four to six weeks. I'm gonna throw Bates D up in there. There we go. Yes, I would like to stop simulating contracts. Oh. Well, I guess I simulated through it. Wonderful job. Birmingham again. And we won, thank goodness. Thank goodness, thank goodness. I don't understand why Armstrong's not scoring like 30 a game. I understand I have a lot of offensive power, but yeah, just annoying. Kansas City now. We're going to lose. That's big. Lost big. Career high of 24. Are you kidding me? That scrub. He's back. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Since said that I'd rather have Bates D up in the freaking. That doesn't make any sense. There we go. Tampa Bay now 7 and 6. We're 5 and 7. This is a championship roster, though. I don't understand why we're not killing it. Thank you. We win 74. Or 78 to 74. Some through this date. Now we got St. Louis again. They're 5 and 
tiles that they stank. Nice. We win. Seventy-three, sixty-four. Okay, seven, seven on the year. Let's take a look. Playoff picture. Not at the playoff picture because that's not accurate as far as standings go. Green Bay is good this year. Wow. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, we're in it, but not by a lot. We get hot though, then we could easily bounce our way back up. There's a good start. Great game there. Against the Columbus Aviators. Now we got Fort Worth against the Rally Blue Jays. Who? Come on, pull away. Let's go. We win another. Playing well right now. Playing well. Playing well. Playing well. Baltimore now. Nice, got another one. Nice game there. Now we got Tampa Bay. No. Yeah, okay. We got flip the script in the second half. Look at that. We killed him in the second half. We won by 17 points. Okay, we're 11 and 7. That's 18 games in. Let's take a look at league leaders. We haven't done that. Okay, why is scoring so down this year? Not 100% sure why scoring's down so much this year, but I didn't realize. Hey, how about it? I still want Wake High. Look at that efficiency. 50, 50, 95. 50, 50, 98. He declined this player option. He is who we're going after this offseason. Alright, we killed Bronx. So we didn't. We only won by six. Okay, we got Columbus again. Graham's hurt. That is not good for us. That is not good at all for us. You're not playing anymore. 35% from the field. No thanks. Montgomery, I gotta give you a chance, man. You've produced when you've been given the chance. Especially since we're losing our center here. Look, Mayberry's playing really bad, so he's not the player he used to be. Look at that. His first two years, solid, solid player, all NBA type guy. Montgomery just might be a guy now. We're also going to give Anderson here the checks to see what he performs like. See what's up. We got 12 and 7 against the Columbus Aviators. Close game. One point game. There we go. We win. 80 to 75. Ge Geiger had 15. But Hart 22. Armstrong 20. And uh, we pulled through on that one. How many threes is he attempting? He hadn't attempted any in his career. Now he's 3 for 4. Shooting 75%. He has been let loose. Now we got Rally again. 14 and 8. They're a good team. But we just killed him. Let's go. Bates Diop is a good player. He should really get more minutes. He's not shooting well from 3 this year. He's shooting really bad from 3, in fact. But. I'll take it. I'll take the win all day. Pittsburgh, once again, good. They got Peterson still, but we killed him. Let's go. Fort Worth, this might be, I'm not going to say it. Though. We're just playing well right now, playing really well. 
Right, we got Pittsburgh again. Is this our last game? No, we got two more games. Two more games. Simcast. Hmm, Pittsburgh. They got us there. And our win streak. They have so many good players. They have Eric Williamson. They got Peterson, who's starting to struggle. He's 28 years old now. Started off really well and just took a dip from there. Is he their leading scorer anymore? He is, just barely. Russ Jameson. Not the same Jameson that we had. Okay. All right. Um, one more game. Frankie Graham is back. Okay, good. How's Montgomery playing? He's playing well. I'm keeping him in there. Anderson is not. One second. All right. Sorry, I had to sneeze and that just was wonderful. Shout out Francisco Mayberry. He was a legend. Except he wasn't a legend. What am I even talking about? Graham, come on. You need more minutes. There we go. 35, and we'll give you 28. There we go. Last game against the Bronx. But before we do that, let's take a look at the standings. Pittsburgh, Green Bay, and us. Green Bay's good this year. Wow. We're both making it work with the trades that we made way back way, way back when. Come on, guys. Not how we wanted to end the year. 30-point loss. Killed us in the second half. All right. Our boy, Donovan Armstrong, 18.8 .8 points, four rebounds, five assists, a steal and a half and a half. Of a block a game wins MVP. He led the league in scoring. I don't know why everybody just decided to stop, stop scoring points, but uh, they did. Kelvin Bullard. Bullard wins Rookie of the Year for the Kansas City Stealth. He was the first overall pick last year. 84 overall already. Wow. Eric Williamson. Sixth man of the year once again. Look at those percentages, man. Cameron Henry wins Defensive Player of the Year. He's 33, but he's playing some extremely good basketball in Birmingham. Glenn Wood, dude way back when in the day. Oh, he had a good year this year. He had a really good year. And Otis Newman, I don't know if that's our guy or not, but he wins Coach of the Year, and then Daniel Wells wins Executive Donovan Armstrong, Jacob Peterson, Cliff Hall Holloway, D. Wheeler, and Cameron Henry are the first team. Glenn Wood, William Caldwell, Jonathan Lydon, Wake High, and Philip Blake. We need you, Wake High. Look at those percentages, man. He he's he's a big target. And then all NBA third team, Frankie Graham, Jin Lee, another first overall pick. Lance Parker, Chase Fox, and Richie Flores, now all defensive team. How about that? Donovan Armstrong, all defensive first team. Same with Dan Hart. Then we got Frankie Graham on the second team. And rookie teams. Hayes, Rice, Newman, Rivers, Blard, of course, Singleton, Fox, Romero, Griffin, and Zagarak. There's those. Playoffs. We got the four seed. Okay. Let's see what we can do here. We got the Bronx Empire, who just killed us last game. Who just killed us and eliminated us again. Simulate the playoffs. They win. Five seeded Bronx Empire got hot late. And they win. D. Wheeler gets finals MVP. Let's take a look.
Yep, another brand new champion. Rally almost repeated, but uh, brand new champion is among us. Owen Craig, Percy Houston, and a whole bunch of other players. Retire, not actually that many, but still. After only four years, bro, man. Come on, dog. Y'all are still producing. Too. Yeah, yeah, he just had the best year of his career. He didn't actually, but he's had a great year. Fifty-four percent from the field. You sure? I can understand that. Pietro, we'll miss you, Pietro. Shout out. Um, Xander Tatum. He was just, he was a marquee player way back in the day, and only averaged a career high of eleven point six. Just look at it. So Perry Bosch, he played with us a little bit. Shout out. Um, okay, that's the end of retired players league meetings. Add a new team. Approved. Everything else I think is good. What do we have the shot clock at right now? I don't think there is one. Or is there? Thirty seconds. We have a thirty second shot clock, which is fine. We'll just keep thirty seconds. And advance, league realignment, Jacksonville in the southeast, good, central, Atlantic, nope, there, Atlantic, central, and central, we're in the northwest. Louisville and Kansas City, or St. Louis, and uh, here we go. That's what we got going on. That's what it should be. Jacksonville Barracuda down in the Southeast Division. Staff signing. Everybody's good. Advancing them there. Expansion draft protects players. Let's see here. Protect everybody, but eh, I don't even want Brad Anderson. He's probably going to get cut, but expansion draft. We got Barracuda. Oh my gosh. Ian Anderson. Looks like a solid. They got, they're getting some solid players. Anderson, Jaden Riley, Cody Harrison, Mitch Martin, Daryl Hickman, Alvarez, Mitchell Garrett's still around. Shout out to him. He's been drafted twice. He was a first overall pick, wasn't he? He was a high draft pick. That was from uh, outside of the U.S. Malcolm Rawlings, Frank Wolf, Newman, Carpenter. They picked up Carpenter up. Zach Hodge, and yeah, that's it. Rookie or maybe draft? Do we have we have a user pick? We have back-to-back -back picks that I'd love to trade, but I don't think I'm. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to. Of course not. Let's see here. Anybody that we scouted? We got a 68 overall center, which I'm not really interested in. He is the fourth best player, so we'll just pick him, and then we'll pick somebody else. So we got Cody Carpenter, and then we'll pick somebody else, uh, like the B-minus overall guy. All right, that's the end of that. There's 18 picks in the first round. There should only be... That's just not right. Who wants it? Everybody wants it for a second rounder, and I'm simply not interested. Can I get a guard? No, I either get a three level score. Yeah, we'll go with the stretch four. And then that's it. Crawford went first. Well, um, let's see. 
was 14 picks in the first round. Who did the Barracuda get the last pick in the first round? That's not right. Uh, let's see here. We got 66 and 69 overall. Okay. We'll see if we keep them around. We had more picks. Yeah, I don't. I don't want any of them. <laughs> except, yeah, just accept all these. Wait, guy declined. Let's see what we can do. But it's the only one I'd want back. We can afford them. Okay, we can afford them. Blossom game. Oh, jeez. Matthew Turner. Bum. Okay, let's see here. He wants... 24 million, and he wants... Well, let's see. We gotta keep Blossom game. So we'll sign you to a four-year max contract. And then we'll sign Blossom game. To a five year deal. That'll take us over the cap. Philip Blake is only 22. Wow. 88 overall. I'd also like Eric Williamson, but I won't wake Kai more. So we didn't get him. Whoa. Vaughn's on the free, free market. He signed in the Bronx. He signed with the champions. Okay, so do we go after Williamson or do we go after someone else? We definitely need... I'd be willing to trade literally everything we got for Wake. I, I just want him so bad. I can afford you, but do I want to afford you? Richard Walls, another solid guy from Green Bay. I feel like you are someone I should offer. I'll just give you the max. And I'd trade him for Wake Eye because I really don't care about Philip Blake. Like I said, we didn't get him. Okay. Bates Diop. We definitely need him. Brandon Vaughn. We need him. They matched. Okay, so we need to get our guys. We got Vaughn here. No, he doesn't deserve a five-year deal. We'll give him eight and a half for three years with a team option. And who else did we lose? Bates Diop. Two-year deal worth six. Six a year, I should say. Is there any other Glenn Wood? Try sign Glenn Wood. To the max deal, trade him for Wake High, because he's not coming to. Yeah, he he'll he'll accept that. I don't have enough room for him. So that sucks. Cameron's going to be on the move. Montgomery, 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 Montgomery. Where's my phone? It's right there, okay. He didn't retire, did he? Where is he? Somebody else sign him. Can't even do a freaking player search because this game just sucks.
Where did he go? Is he really a 60 something overall? He might be. Let's see here. Let's go alphabetical. Yeah, he's not in here. So who are we going to? Courtney Young played with us in the past. I just don't know if we can afford anybody. No, we got like two million in cap. So we can sign you, I guess, to a six and a half million deal. Um, Clement's still not played a game, which is kind of crazy to me. Where's Billick? I guess I have to announce the rights. Blunt. Should I, should I get Blunt? Blunt's just another guy that came to us and started second after we signed him. That 14 points a game. Thought he was going to turn into something crazy, but uh, never did. Can't afford Billick, so we lost him. Okay. Just got to sign people to minimum deals. That was definitely a one game thing. Need some guards, shooting guard. How about Jesse Chandler for two one five? He doesn't like that. Okay, I'll two five. They match the offer sheet, really? For a guy that they don't even play. Freaking Bronx is pissing me off, man. foot three guy maybe okay so we got six nine and then three so that's twelve
running him. No, he just looks the same as the guy. Cardinal, no, just hmm. Rear, not possible. So I need just one more guy at least. I suppose we'll go with Jameson. There we go. Ninety seven overall. Hearts are getting worse, which isn't ideal. We need to go after Waikai. We need to try to figure out a package that can get us Waikai. Auto-generate as per usual. Armstrong's already in A. Glass Cameron, maybe. Anybody else that's young that I actually want to keep around? I guess Graham. All right, so that's going to do it for Season 5 here. Of the Fort Worth Armadillos and the NBA Restart. Disappointing to see that all I could do is expand by six teams. Very disappointing, i got to be honest. So, yeah. I suppose that will be all from me. Thanks, everybody. Check out localized content on YouTube. Localized underscore content on Twitch. And I'll see you all in the next episode. Goodbye.